गुड इवनिंग आई एम अयंगराज फ्रॉम इंडिया जमशेदपुर झारखंड माई प्रोजेक्ट इज ऑटो एक्सीडेंट डिटेक्शन सिस्टम द सेवेंथ गोल ऑफ यू एन इंडस्ट्री इनोवेशन एंड इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर ओके सो कैन आई शेयर माई स्क्रीन दिस इज माई प्रोजेक्ट ऑटो एक्सीडेंट डिटेक्शन सिस्टम What is my project? Introducing our revolutionary auto accident detection system, a versatile safety solution designed to be seamless integrated into any vehicle from cars to bike. This innovation system utilizes cutting edge technology to swift detect and respond to accident, ensuring prompt assistance and potentially save lives. With its universal capability, it can be effortlessly installed in any vehicle or even integrated into a bike helmet, making safety accessible. to all powered by advanced sensor and intelligent algorithms our accident detection system offer peace of mind on the road empowering drivers and riders with protective safety measures our accident detection system employs advanced sensor and algorithms to monitor vehicles motion and location in the event of an accident this system swiftly analyzes sensor data from for sudden change uh, indicates of a collision such as rapidly declaration of or impact force exceeding a predetermined threshold once an accident is detected the system triggers alert notifying drivers passengers and emergency services this alert can take various form including audible alarms visual indicators wireless signals simultaneously uh, the system automatically contact emergency services providing them with a curricular information such as the vehicle's gps coordinates and the uh, and the severity of the accident with its seamless integration into any vehicle or helmet our system offers universal safety coverage ensuring prompt assistant and potentially save lives its user friendly interface also allows for easy monitoring and configuration empowering users with protective safety measures on the road how does the project work we have arduino gsm gps module ADXL gyroscope sensor, MQ3 alcohol sensor, I infrared sensor, Neo6 GPS module. So when the car runs, the gyroscope sensor calibrate the angular velocity. Sorry, uh, the gyroscope sensor measure the angular velocity of the car. Then uh, if it's detect any kind of danger, so it trigger the Arduino and then Arduino command the GPS module to measure the coordinates and send it to nearest police station or hospital. so you can see over 1.9 million people around the world uh, die because of not uh, taking help on time and uh, the united states is united states is a major country with road accident dies okay so this is my project diagram and wiring this is arduino nano the brain of the computer this is adxl 345 gyroscope sensor which measure and calibrates the angular velocity of the car or bike this is gps module which send the data and this is gsm module which measure the coordinates so uh, here's a small video you can see in which i have made uh, this is my project this is adxl 345 gyroscope sensor which uh, measure the angular velocity of the car this is arduino nano this is neo 6 mb gps module this is sim 800 module this is buck converter module uh, when i hit this adxl 345 sensor you can see uh, i run it with 12 volt power supply and uh, the, uh, there is the wiring of the project and uh, when i hit this sensor uh, wait when i hit this sensor you can see the alert message will come and call will also come you can see in my smartphone the call has been come from gps system if i decline the call it will send the coordinate gps proper gps location to me you can see the gps uh, location has been come and when i click to it the google maps will open and uh, tell me the nearest path you can see here so this is my project
Okay, now, how do the project will help the society? The auto accident detection system offers significant benefits to society, enhance safety by promptly detecting accident and initiating emergency response protocols. The system can reduce response time and improve outcome of accident victims, potentially saving lives. Universal acceptability. It's compatibly with any vehicle type, including cars and bikes, ensure that safety measures are accessible to a wide range of individual regardless of the vehicle they use. Reduce road faculties. By providing protective accident detection and emergency assistance, the system contributes to reducing road fatalities. Road fatalities and injury, making roads safe, safer for everyone. Efficient emergency response, the system's automatic alert mechanism ensures the emergency services and promptly notified of accidents, enabling them to respond swiftly and efficiently, thereby reducing the impact of accident on traffic flow and minimizing congestion. Peace of mind, knowing that they have a reliable safety system in place, can provide drivers and riders with peace of mind, allowing them to focus on the journey without worrying about potential accident. Over the auto accident detection system, plays a particular role in prompting road safety, improving emergency responses, and enhancing the well-being of society as a whole. So this is my project. The auto accident detection system aims to enhance road safety throughout innovative technology by leveraging sensors and machine learning algorithms. The system can detect and analyze vehicle accident in real time, enabling enabling uh, enabling swift response for from emergency services it's potentially to uh, reduce response time and save lives makes it a promising advancement in the realm of road safety technology thank you wow so, that's uh, nice thank you sir I have a question. What was the biggest problem you had in putting this together? Uh, the biggest problem I have, uh, I see uh, the people with road accident have uh, have uh, not take help from time. See, okay, so they not uh, we not we can't reach them on time, so that uh, the less of time they die. So I have made this project in which the the needy uh, we can help the needy on time uh, without uh, asking from them. We have the location of them, so we can directly contact them, and we can find them and give them help. Okay. Can you show your slide with the project diagram again? Because you just have a bunch of words here. Okay, sir. Ah, great, great. Very good. Amazing. This is my. Did you Thank say you, that you could also put this into bike helmets? Uh, sorry, ma'am. I did you say? I think you said at the beginning that this could be used in bike helmets as well. Is that correct? Yeah. Yes. This this can be used in bike helmets also because uh, we uh, uh, we integrate this whole project in the bike's helmet, and then if the driver. Uh, driver got accident the helmet will automatically send the uh, send location and call the nearest police station and nearest hospital that's amazing yes i um, i see Yo, go ahead amy i'm sorry hello uh, all, yeah we have so many questions for you because oh, it's such a great project um how long have you been working on this is one question oh and then the other one is what inspired you to do this uh my neighbor uh, there is an uncle who expired last year and her family become uh, they uh, become on road so i made this project because i see that many people like youngsters mostly youngsters are dying from the road accident and if the youngsters uh, if youngsters will die so what will uh, what was the future of our future what will our future if the youngsters will die so i have made this project that uh, everybody uh, we can help them on time anyone who needs help we can help them on time um, i see you're operating this off you're using a nano 
the Arduino Nano, how are you powering it? Yes. Where did the electrical power come from? Uh, sir, I powered it with a uh, 12 volt power supply, but in car, I powered it with a battery, a but, dedicated battery for this whole project. Okay, so the battery from the car. Yeah. And what about the bicycle helmet? Uh, helmet, I have, um, so, so, sir, I, uh, sir, a dedicated battery for this project. If I do it with bike helmet, I uh, pre-installed the uh, battery in the helmet for this project only. Okay. So how does somebody know when the battery has gone dead? If the battery has gone dead and there's no power, this device will not work. How do you know that the battery yes, has gone dead? Uh, sir, uh, I can use uh, power, uh, power trans uh, like uh, I can use uh, battery uh, BMS battery management system, uh, which shows the power indication. The battery is full charge, fifty percent, twenty five percent, like that, sir. Yeah, that is an excellent answer. You you gave a very good answer, and you should put that into your presentation because people are going to worry. What if the battery is dead and you have a management system that will give them that information? So uh, my recommendation is include that because that's an important part of the safety feature. Okay, sir. Very, very good answer. So this project, okay. if any driver will, uh, if any driver takes alcohol or uh, and drive the car, uh, the car handle, uh, I'm not, uh, uh, sorry. Uh, I am not uh, include that in the project, but my idea is that ki, uh, if somebody is taking alcohol and then he drives the car, so the car uh, steering wheel uh, gives him a shock, a short shock uh, <laughs> in which the alcohol. <laughs> that may just, if the person is drunk, that may just make them angry and they will <laughs> rip things apart. <laughs> How about instead of a shock, maybe just a flashing light? <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. If they are drunk, maybe then it calls the police and tells them this person is driving when he shouldn't be. Or maybe it allows it not to start the car. Or start the car. Mm -hmm. So they can't go anywhere. Or, or call, oh, we lost him. Oh, he froze and then we dropped out. Oh, no. Or maybe it calls their insurance company and cancels their insurance policy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hope he comes back. Me too, too. All the internet is a wonderful thing when it works. Oh, well. Dr. Rich Richardson has something there, too. Yeah, it, it, I heard someone say something about uh, operating a motor vehicle. While, oh, sweat gland uh, sensor, yeah. yeah it, it would have to have a sweat gland sensor because there would be no no other way to. It would be too much of a, a technology construction. To Hello. A breathalyzer. Or sorry, sir, because, uh, sir, uh, sorry, because of internet interruption. Uh, it, Hello. It, Yes, you're fine now. It happens all the time to everybody. <laughs> Sorry, sir. It's, it's perfectly fine. So this is my idea. And uh, in new cars like Tesla Motors, they uh, integrate this software, but this is uh, that is very expensive. So every people can't afford it. So this system is very, uh, uh, you can say that very uh, budget friendly that everyone can afford it and use it in his or his, uh, her vehicle. Very good. Have you contacted anybody about making this, putting it together commercially? Uh, sorry, sir, but anyone uh, don't agree with do accident in road. Okay. But there is a gentleman connected with GIFT, and his name is Anand Kanan, and he does a lot of things with entrepreneurship in India. And um, if you write to me, because I won't remember this conversation, but send me an email and I will send you his contact information. And Sir, uh, can I have your email? Yeah, 
Well, you have it because it's the one when I send you all the information. You've gotten the emails from me, haven't you? No, sir. Yes, you have. Because how did you know to be on this pod, this uh, webinar? Uh, global elevation field trip is your email. That will that will get to me. That will get to oh, me. Okay, sir. And okay, sir. Okay, sir. Write to me, and I will send you Mr. Kanan's contact information. And I think he will be very interested in talking with a young student from India who has a great idea and needs some help turning it into a project, a product. Yes, sir. He is very good with that. Excellent, excellent work. So what's your next project? Uh, my next project, I am uh, focusing on uh, uh, as we are rapidly polluting our mother planet Earth. So in future, the uh, humans can't be uh, live in this planet. So I want to make uh, Mars a habitable planet and my future project is to make an electric power rocket. Great, great. I'm looking forward to that also. Excellent. Thank you, sir. Amy, I, I think we're done. If you, I know it's a little bit early, but if you want to introduce your, you've got one student and uh, I'm sure more will be joining the mashup. Yes, we are excited about the upcoming mashup. I'm sure they'll be joining here in a yeah. few minutes. I know Sid's coming back. Yeah. Anyak, we have a, the next session is a students from around the world talking about some issues. And you're welcome to join them. Please don't leave. Now that you have your internet working, join the conversation, okay? Yes, sir. Okay. Amy, it's all yours. It's all mine. Well, Anyak, I'd like to th thank you for presenting and sharing your great idea. I think it's a great life-saving tool and would help a lot of people and would bring, as you said, a peace of mind um, to many people, especially parents of young drivers and kids that are out on bikes and everything. So thank you for your work and keep up the good work. Thank you, ma'am.